Good morning, guys. Um, I received several questions last night. Um, thank you for those. And um, one of them regards uh, how to practice kick serves at home. Uh, kick serves is a top spin serve, so uh, let's see what we can do about it. Um, since we're hitting, we want to hit top spin, we want our motion to go strictly up while the bow is moving down. And when we serve, you can use a lot of things to amplify this upward motion. Uh, part of it is from a normal setup, you go to the top of your backswing, and then from here you can really move your legs up, so feet, knees, hips, shoulders, and then everything goes up, so you can really load yourself and then go up. That's gonna create this upward motion. But at home, we gotta do something else. So maybe let me grab a chair. So I can show you what the motion of the racket is and what happens with the ball when you do this motion. So uh, imagine that this is my normal stance. I'm serving towards the wall behind you. I'm doing my back swing and my racket goes behind my back. From here, the racket goes straight up, right? All the way that I can reach. So this is my upward motion. It's driven by the shoulder. So shoulder, elbow, hand, and the racket goes straight up. And when you toss the ball, it reaches the apex and then it starts to drop. So when the ball drops down and the racket goes up, the ball tends to spin forward. And then after the bounce, it kicks up, right? So what I want you to practice at home, uh, I'll try to hit over the painting if I can. So you go here, you drop the racket behind the back, and then you toss the ball and you're trying to go straight up. No forward motion, no turning, straight up. And as you can see, the ball bounced off the wall and because it had forward spin, it actually kicked up. I'll try to do it one more time. From here, you go straight up. Right? Use softball so you don't damage the wall or you disturb your neighbors. But that's something that you can do at home. Um, if you have tall ceilings, you can be standing up. If, or a chair is good, you can be on your knees. Right? And then toss the ball, wait for it to drop, and then try to go straight up from the shoulder, and then try to drive the motion straight up to the top of your reach without the intention of you know, turning the hand around or moving forward. And that's going to create this top spin. One more time. All right, three in a row. <laughs> uh, thank you. If you have other questions or comments, send them my way, and I'll do my best to help you. Bye.